Good morning. <clears throat> good morning. Good morning. Happy Monday. Happy New Week. Happy like everything, right? All right. Who's going to be first? Oh, Dip from Florida winning today. Uh, she is first. Congratulations. Debra wins. Woohoo. We should really start doing that. Um, actually, that, that's an idea. I'm, I'm going to have to think on that. But I wonder if we can do something that incentivizes like the first person. Um, and I don't know if that would be fair because I think, I don't think, I don't think it presents in the order. Um, so say for instance, five people uh, join at 9.59. I'm not sure that the first person that joined at 9.59 would show at 10. But I wonder if there's a little something we can do to incentivize um, uh, participants and attendance. All right, anyway, just another idea, right? Happy Monday. Um, okay. Yeah, we're all around the world. It really, really is. As, as I look, I'm like, okay, there's Brazil, there's the UK, there's Florida, there's Minnesota. Um, all right, so let's just jump into it. What do I have? So Rhinobot, look at my eyes, look how tired I am. Oh my God, that looks terrible. It looks like I got like eat up or something. Um, I didn't. I just have, I have kids and uh, our daughter just wants to cry all night. It's just what she wants to do. Um, but it's okay. I have rhino blood and I'll keep going. Anyway, let me finally get into some stuff. All right, rhino bot, we did work on, excuse me, over the weekend. I don't know where it's at right now. I will know by 12 o'clock. Because uh, that's the time that I have a call with our team. Um, but it's in a good place. Like I said, I was testing it Friday, and then I went ahead and tested it too hard, and it, uh, you know, messed up. But the fact that all you need to do is reset it to go exactly back to where I was Friday, which was a really good place to begin with. And, of course, there's some improvements that need to be done. But I think those improvements might have been done over the weekend or will at least be done today. Um, like I said, got to talk to the team. But Rhino Bot's in a really good place. Uh, the webinar, I finally did the replay for it. Um, and what was what was difficult about the replay was that after Tuesday's webinar, I wanted to do the replay, right? I want to edit it. Well, then before you know it, it's Wednesday's webinar. And you're like, okay, well, I said a couple of good things in Wednesday that were a little bit better than Tuesday. Um, let's go ahead and edit it together. Then Thursday comes around. And Thursday, I'm like, oh, I said a lot of really good things that were better than Wednesday and Tuesday. So let me take that part and let me. Points being, um, I should have known, but I didn't know that the best way to edit a webinar is, is not to edit one, like get a whole bunch, put them together and take the best of all of them. So we finally were able to complete that. That is up on the YouTube. That was also in our emails for the weekend. And we made a lander page of it, the webinar replay. So everyone should have it. Um, what I am working on today, because again, tomorrow starts the webinar cycle again, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So we have to go ahead and get registrants. So we're going to, our email today is going to be nudging people to participate, to, to register for it. Um, so I'm, I'm thinking, actually, it makes sense that that email is not going to have the replay in it. Duh, right? Like who's going to attend the webinar if you send them the replay beforehand, but what is cool is that everyone that attends the webinar, we have the replay ready to go so we could send, all right, so that's what we're gonna do. If someone attends the webinar upon the webinar being completed, hey Frida, um, the replay page will be sent to them with the link to join. Actually, that works out pretty perfectly. Okay, perfect. So that, I'll have that done, I don't know, by the end of the day. Um, but we have to have an email that goes out to everyone to welcome them, so that should be a little bit uh, not aggressive, but nudging. Hey, you know, get in, get in, get in, get in. So that's that. Also, we want to turn that webinar page into an affiliate page. The difficulty has been, well, there's two affiliates offers, but I don't want to do two affiliate. I don't want to confuse it, right? So we can have one affiliate offer where it's get people to register for, for the webinar, which is really, that's, that's important. Um, and we could go ahead and reward for each register, registrant. But at the same time, what if the individual doesn't want to web, uh, register for the web webinar and they just, okay, cool, just show me what it is, um, in which case the replay is, is powerful. But actually, now that I think about it, 
who's going to watch a webinar replay if they wouldn't attend the webinar to begin with? Because at least if you offer someone to attend the webinar, A, and if you can't make it, we'll send you the replay. I think that's probably the best. Sorry, I'm, I'm talking out loud, talking out, thinking out loud. So actually, that solves it because we've been spending a couple of days trying to figure out how to do that. You don't want to put too many call to actions on one page. But no, why don't we just have a webinar page and everyone that signs up will automatically be put in a sequence that they will receive the replay immediately after the webinar and that replay will have the buy link in it. In which case, for all of our partners that bring registrants to the webinar, I get to speak to them one-on-one -on -one and you know, Rhino does its thing. And for those that don't join, they get the replay, in which case that's a second chance to get them. Plus we go ahead and um, capture their email addresses so they're in the, the, um, the sequences going out. I think that's perfect, okay. You guys are so helpful. Use webinar fuel. I don't know what that is. Um, I'll look into it, but um, yeah, send it over. Are we still working on one entryway to all of Rhino? Uh, so Deb, I, I didn't even read that you had written that, um, but I think that's I think that's what I'm talking about right now. Um, just to have the webinar, you can see really fast, so it's not too time consuming. Be quick, be brief, be done. Love it. Okay, cool. All right, so everyone agrees. I like it. Uh, so I'll have that completed today, and I will email everyone the the affiliate link to sign up for that along with the reward and how that is rewarded. It'll probably be like maybe one Rhino per sign up or I think that'd be fair. Maybe five Rhino per sign up. No, five Rhino is a lot. That's like $15. One Rhino per sign up. I think that's fair. And that will be sent to your wallet within 30 days. And I do that because Karcher is on a 30 day loop. So it just notifies me. So I'll come in one day and it's like, hey, send free to 30 Rhino. Okay, great, cool. In which case, I'm gonna look at that today. I might actually owe some people Rhino, uh, which I'll send as well. Okay, cool. I can't tell you how happy I am that we just had this conversation. I like honestly had no idea what to do, but that's a good idea and we're gonna do that. All right, as it pertains to Rhino Bucks, please stop me when you've heard this before. New all-time high in members. Well, actually, it's not a new all-time, it's, it's tying the all-time high, 573 but it is a new all-time high in liquidity. We're at 118,000 and a half. Last week, we we're at 115,000. Then we we're at 116,000. Then we we're at 117,000. Yesterday, we we're at 118,000. By tomorrow, we'll probably be at 119,000. That's pretty cool. Like that's kind of just, yeah, that, that's starting to take on a life of its own. It's just going, which is good, right? Like we're all doing a good job. Um, I'm freezing. It's so funny, it's summertime. And I always wear jeans and a jacket and everything. And you might be thinking, Ant, it's summertime. No, I'm in, I'm in an office where they just blast the, the AC. I've never quite understood that. If it's 90 degrees outside, you blast the AC to like 65. But if it's 70 degrees outside, you leave the AC. It's almost like the temperature outside has to be a direct component to how extreme the temperature is inside. It's, it's cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. Anyway. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I think I was going to say something. Oh, okay. That's what it was. So when I was living in New Orleans, there was this gentleman, Roman, who was big into crypto and he had his own coin and all this nonsense. And the way he did his coin was, it was more promotional. It was called Fat Cat Killer. And he owned a club and he owned some places and you know, he would promote it through the places and he would accept it. So it had adoption. And then he would partner with other companies like um, the local auto dealer and stuff like that. And he was really good at the promotional side. So he went ahead and got registered across the board, did, um, did um, Twitter blasts, did uh, Discord blasts, did like all of these different blasts. Um, and just did all the things you would need to do to for your coin to get notoriety for your coin for people to see it and say, okay, great. It, it has this, 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 and this. Well, long story short, I was interested in where his coin is. So I looked at it yesterday and it's 50% below ours. Um, we're at like 118,000. His is at, I think 87,000 or something, which is funny because he's had thousands more people get involved with his so much more notoriety, so much more of everything. So I messaged him and I was like, hey, listen, um, 
would you like to do some type of collab? And he's like, what do you have in mind? I was like, well, I, I just think you should tell all your people to come to Rhino and, you know, we'll, we'll compensate you on it. We'll give you some, you know, we'll give you a package that reflects that. And, you know, it's, it's due over time, whatever the case may be. He's like, yeah, well, I'm not going to do that. But he goes, you still need to do all of this stuff. And we were going through it. He goes, listen, if you did all of this stuff, you would be even bigger and bigger and bigger. He goes, especially if you're something that's unique by doing all this stuff, you would be in the front of everyone that actually looks for this stuff. He goes, right now you have a lot of success, but it's because you're growing your own grassroots organization. Imagine if, imagine if people that actually are looking for this stuff were able to find you. I was like, that would be kind of cool. I was like, well, we're still going to do what we're doing because the momentum is clearly behind us, but we'd be foolish not to go ahead and try to find additional ways to gain notoriety or gain success. So I don't know where that's going, but I have a call today at one o'clock with him. So I just want to share that that could be something kind of cool. Um, and we'll see, right? Uh, he did offer to do the free stuff. And by free, I mean the stuff that just takes labor. Um, additional registrations and being put on different exchanges costs money. But there are some things you can do that it's just because you, it's just clearly know how, oh, you, you should do this. I'll do it for you. So I do think regardless, we will come out better than, I think today's call will put us better than before today's call. Uh, definitely not worse because we could always decline. But I just want to let you know that's happening today at one o'clock. So we'll see. Um, oh, Twitter. So I, I, I have paused the automations on Twitter because we learned that they were successful in terms of traffic, but the execution was terrible. Like we weren't really converting anything. So one of the biggest challenges, or at least, I guess it's a challenge, but really kind of like, I don't want to say the highlight of my day, but something I'm, I'm, I'm excited to do is to just spend an hour or two thinking. Like, like my day is always go, 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 which is fine. Love it. But there are moments of the day or, or there's, there are things that I need to do that are like, okay, great. I need to put aside an hour and just sit there in silence and think. And that's so much fun because you, you know, you have no urgency at the moment. You could just freely be creative. Um, and what I mean by that is we now have the webinar. We have the replay. We have a buy link. We're going to build out the affiliate page to register for the webinar. We have coin. There is some kind of, there is some kind of, 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 of recipe that would equal success. For instance, Okay, if, if for every person that goes ahead and follows the industry leader, what can we say to them? What can we give them for them to be, you know, be happy to accept, right? Like what, it's not even like we're asking people for anything. We're trying to figure out what we can give people that they would like to have. So there's, we have a lot of luxury, a lot of, a lot of good in that, in the sense that we built out the automations, we can go ahead and automatically message anyone we want who follows anyone we want and say anything we want because we have the AI that will go ahead and say it. And like, like we have basically a whole team that's free, right? Because we built it all out. We have coin. So for instance, can we go ahead and say, for every person that signs up for the webinar, we'll give you five Rhino. Just make sure you go ahead and fill out your email address and give us your wallet address here. Well, of course, now the person's like, yeah, well, well I want to receive that. And then in them receiving it, they're giving us all their information so that we can bring them into the fold. The point is the second we find, if the second we crack that code where all of a sudden many people are, are being receptive, like we have a high conversion level, well, we could do that 50,000 times a month. That's our plan right now. That's our, our Zapier plan. Or we could do it hundreds of thousands if we decide to up that plan. So we have, it's like, what's it like? It, it, it's like you have, um, I don't know, whatever is potentially explosive and you just got to put it together, right? So that's exciting. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm excited to spend an hour or two doing that later as well. So that's kind of everything for today. I'm hoping that tomorrow we'll have the Rhino bot to show you. In fact, if you go to rhinobucks.com, it's it's there. It's just not working, but you'll actually see it, which is which is good. Um, so I hope to be able to actually play around with it a little bit tomorrow. Okay, 
So that is all we have for today. And um, all right, I'll see you tomorrow. I will have the affiliate stuff out today because Amelia loves it. Oh, you know, Robert, you. Um, I will have the affiliate stuff out today because again, we do want to go ahead and promote the webinar cycle for the week. Okay, love, 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 love. I'll see you tomorrow.